In this day and age, we are going through so, so much. This is a time where we need to cling on to God. We need to seek his face like never before. So instead of doing my regular teaching and preaching, we're just going to go into the word because we need to stay. We need to remain. We need to get back to the secret place. So please turn with me to Psalms 91. You can follow along with me in your personal Bible or you can just listen. We're going to read the entire Psalm 91. It's a few verses, but it says, He that dwelleth in the secret place of the Most High shall abide under the shadow of the Almighty. I will say of the Lord, He is my refuge and my fortress. My God, in Him will I trust. Surely He shall deliver thee from the snare of the fowler and from the noisome pestilence. He shall cover thee with his feathers, and under his wings shalt thou trust. His truth shall be thy shield and buckler. Thou shalt not be afraid from a terror by night, nor from an arrow that flieth by day, nor from the pestilence that walketh in darkness, nor from the destruction that wasteth at noonday. A thousand shall fall at thy side, and ten thousand at thy right hand, but it shall not come nigh thee. Only with thine eyes shalt thou behold the sea for reward of the wicked. Because thou hast made the Lord, which is my refuge, even the most high of thy habitation. There shall no evil befall thee, neither shall any plague come nigh thy dwelling. For he shall give his angels charge over thee, to keep thee in all thy ways. They shall bear thee up in their hands, lest thou dash thy foot against the stone. Thou shalt tread upon the lion and the and adder. The young lion and the dragon shalt thou trample under feet. Because he hath set his love upon me. Therefore will I deliver him. I will set him on high because he hath known my name. He shall call upon me and I will answer him. I will be with him in trouble. I will deliver him and honor him. With long life will I satisfy him and show him my salvation. My friends, we got to get back to the secret place. We got to get back under the covering of God. I had reposted a video a few days ago. And it was a man of God who received the prophetic download from the Lord who was saying to anoint your homes. Please go back and watch that. Do that. Anoint your homes. We need to pray. We need to seek God's face like ever before. Fast. Read the word. We got to do all that. We got to get back to the secret place. There's no other safety. There's no safety in money. There's no safety in things. There's only true safety in Jesus Christ. So my friends, take heed. Let's get back to the secret place.